Hi and welcome to the zoo. My name is Miss Natalie and today I have with me my friend Bramble. Can anybody tell me whether Bramble is a hedgehog or a porcupine? If you guessed hedgehog, you're absolutely right. There's a lot of differences between hedgehogs and porcupines. For one thing, a porcupine is actually a type of rodent, so they are more closely related to squirrels and groundhogs, whereas a hedgehog is not related to any of those animals. The reason why hedgehogs and porcupines can sometimes be confused with one another is because of something called convergent evolution. This means that sometimes two different species can develop very similar body plans in completely different environments. Something else that sets hedgehogs apart from porcupines is their quills. A hedgehog does not have true quills. They actually have very thick modified hairs. So when a hedgehog feels scared or threatened, they will curl up into a very tight ball and their spines or their hairs will stick out in all different directions. It's kind of like when you or I get scared and the hair on our arm stands up. Something else that hedgehogs do that's really cool is called anointing. When a hedgehog encounters something that smells interesting or irritating, they will lick that thing and they'll create a thick, frothy paste with their spit. And then they will lick that spit all over their backs and that can help disguise them to the smell of their environment or it can also help defend them by adding toxins to their hairs. Hedgehogs are nocturnal animals. Does anybody know what nocturnal means? That's right. Nocturnal means they're awake in the nighttime. So you can think nocturnal night. Hedgehogs sleep most of the day. So before I put Bramble back to bed, I'm going to give everyone an opportunity to touch him if you'd like to. I'd like you to only use two fingers and I'd like you to only touch him one at a time as I bring him around. Thanks. 